Some of here. Why did Frey spin your face? No. Speak of Balder. He claims nothing harms him. Aye. Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. The boasting of a god. Everyone has a weakness. Not him, I'm afraid. Balder is blessed with invulnerability to all threats, physical or magical. You just said that, Mimir. Did I? What is the source of this power? Well, as I recall, it involved, uh, a spell? Mimir? Parts of my brain must still be coming back to life. Just need a moment to finish waking up. <laughs> I mean, he was He's dead. <laughs> he might be broken. I think we should give him some time. Like, coming back to life is hard work. Like, even waking up while you're still alive is hard. Never mind waking up once you've been dead. Come here. We're on the lake. Perfect. Dock us near the bridge. Not yet. Where's the army? Oh, he's moved his head away. Is he upset with us? Come here. You never did tell me why Freya spit in your face. Well, she blames me in large measure for her present circumstances. And not totally without reason. It all goes back to the long war between the Aesir and Vanir. Prior to that, wars for the Aesir were easily won. But the Vanir had proved their equal and exacted devastating damage. Both sides suffered tremendous losses. And for many of us, quite frankly, war was simply no fun anymore. But a rather senseless waste of precious life. Wouldn't you agree, brother? <clears throat> Precisely. Enough was enough. And at last, Odin's most brilliant advisor became determined to find a more enlightened path. He set about to broker a peace between the gods. It took some convincing, but ultimately Odin was persuaded to marry his deadliest enemy. A certain Vanir goddess, legendary not only for her fertile beauty, but her genius at the very Vanir magic that Odin had long aspired to master. Freya married Odin? What was in it for her? So I was right. It was a sacrifice to protect her people. A selfless act of love. Truly, she deserves better than she got. But of course, there's more to that story. Sounds like shit hit the fan, because, like, they're not together anymore. It seems. Although he did have a raven stationed by her house. So were they like Odin's arrows? <laughs> Do my arrows still work? Oops, that's not it. Do the arrows still work? Okay, yes. Right, well, I'm not doing this. I just wanted to see what this Tears, said. braziers. A symbol of the light that binds all realms together. Why would he use those strange runes, though? Now you mention it, he wouldn't. Uh. What's that supposed to mean? Also, I wasn't asking you, Mimia, or what the hell have you seen him? I was asking Rose. <laughs> she sat with her back to me just howling she's funny um i was trying to ask my boy because we finally found the cipher what's the chance that we found the cipher at the same time as we have you who can read all this shit here we go this needs a different cipher than the one we have. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> Fine. Fine. Mimia also has new memory about the things he just said. <laughs> god help us all. Okay. I wonder if... All of the these are different ones. <gasps> we could right. I've just seen Odin's Raven from all this far away. No, oh, I could pop to the island, but actually, there's no ciphers on that one anyway, so there's no point. Let's pop to this one. Ooh, let's grab this. Oh, 
Oh, I don't even think we can get on this one. I can't believe Odin and Freya were ever married. Love and hate are more closely intertwined than you might imagine. For instance, Odin hates the giants and they him. But Thor's own mother no, is the giantess Fjorgun, one of Odin's great loves. So Thor's half god and half giant? Where? So she is the Thor's mom. Lonely ages past. And as Fjorgun. war with the Vanir raged, I could see what he really wanted beneath his bluster. And after no small amount of convincing, Freya agreed. Okay. And there he really turned on the charm. He seemed happy. He seemed interested in making her happy. He granted her so many wishes, I can scarcely recall them all. The peace held, and I truly believed all had worked out better than I could have planned. But Odin's true face showed itself again in the end. He won Freya's trust, and she taught him some of her Vanir magic, another choice she would live to bitterly regret. Okay. Sadly, despite his wise counselor's best efforts to persuade him that peace was the only true path to stave off Ragnarok, Odin never let go of his obsession with Jotunheim. The taste of Vanir magic led him to new forms of experimentation and new levels of depravity. Okay. This is all very insightful. So, Odin first fell in love with a giant, had Thor, giant died, then got with Freya. Was that out of love or was that just out of like, because? And then she taught him some magic. He's now abusing it. She regrets it. So who is Baldur's mum? Where's my codex? Where's my law? Death of the Raven God, Lord of the Hanged. So she's like death to him, so like, yeah, something happened. Oh, okay. I'm, I'm not going to find the ones I'm looking for, I don't think. What was that one that was about Boulder? The one that we just found recently. Was it this one? What is this one? Hail Frigg, generous Frigg, who gave the world her brightest light. So this was at the witch's house as well, wasn't it? Oh, but maybe... Oh, this is like an... A lost stone that's been there for ages. So this might not have been her. Um, so Frigg is... Baldur's... Mother. Okay. All right. We're, we're putting things together slowly. Not surely, but slowly. Uh, you love how they make Odin obsessed with Ragnarok in this. It makes sense. Like, if... If it was foretold the end of... The world? Like... People would be obsessed with it, and especially, like, powerful people. Um... With Freya, he got because of the peace between Vanir and Aesir. From his side, it was for peace as well. I thought it was just from her side she did it for the peace. Baldur's mother, mother is Frigg, yes. I was trying to figure out if Frigg and Freya is the same person. I guess not. Uh... Is Odin a fuckboy? <laughs> yes, actually, maybe not. Zeus, definitely. Zeus is our dad, right? <laughs> um, as, as well as many others. Champion fuckboy. <laughs> what? <laughs> Slowly and poo. <laughs> Nailed it, Black Hole. Oh, I can read what this says now. But 
It's a name. Air! Whoa! The name made it light up! It's Whoa. the name of one of the Valkyries. That's quite curious. What was that? Ah, oh, right, so it's too late. <laughs> Codex. Nope. Goals. It was a labour, wasn't it? Something that I've done one of. Braziers lit. Right? Restore light to the realm towers. Okay. Light tears. Braziers on the realm towers around the Lake of Nine. All right, we can do that. Some of that, it seems. So I wonder how many this is gonna wake up. You just noticed Black Horn slowly and poo. <laughs> Black Horn's being trolled now. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> I wonder if when we speak to the world snack he's gonna leave and if that's gonna open <sighs> but things can't get lower because then we won't be able to get up to the towers anymore okay obviously the marriage to Odin didn't last but, but how are we gonna get this fragment in the woods oh that was a singular piece of cruelty even for Odin as if the marriage wasn't punishment enough Freya was better to him than he deserved he stuck it out through all manner of indignity, all in the name of maintaining peace and safety for her people. But Odin's madness, his tyranny, his corruption of her magics, it became more than she could stomach, and at long last she broke it off. Mm -hmm. Odin's wrath was fierce, and his curses upon her were more than she dared to fear. But her magic was so much stronger than his. After so much time together, he knew her vulnerabilities, and exploited them to craft curses she could never break. Oh, like not being able to leave Midgard. Worse still, he robbed her of her warrior spirit. Freya cannot fight, even to defend herself. No living thing ah. may she harm by blade nor spell. In She's literally cursed. What to choice do that? does she have but isolation? Poor Freya. I guess if I was her, I'd spit in your face too. Aye, <laughs> lad. So would I. <laughs> Okay, so, wait, what did, oh, fuck me. I'm only taking in about 50% of stuff. What did Mamiya have to do with that? Did he help Odin with the magic stuff? Um, so, right. He, she is now cursed to not be able to do uh shit like fight defend herself another name i think we need to protect her another valkyrie that's no coincidence but who'd have etched them on tears braziers are we summoning valkyries so there's eight braziers oh yeah one for each realm and then none for jotunheim He was a genius advisor who came up with the great plans that he thought would fix it, i.e. the marriage. Okay. Um, he broke peace and convinced Freya to marry Odin. So, yeah, she's like, great idea, prick. <laughs> Basically. Right, so there's not one over here. There won't be one in there. I feel like I'm missing some towers. Is it gonna tell me which ones I've lit? So I've lit these two. Oh frick. Oh, I'll be able to see which ones I've lit because they're lit. There they are. So I've lit the one next to Snake. This one and this one. Oh yeah, and this isn't even a tower, what am I thinking? Okay. And uh, we know we can't this is where the tower to Jotunheim should be. do them all yet, anyway. Feels strange somehow. Oh, this no is- No doubt some oh. arcane magics were involved. 
I would be not at all surprised to learn you are sensitive to that. Oh. I really think our boy is the god of something. I know he's like god of best Simeon. boy, but something there was else. There's a shrine about a giant lady. Lots of books and, and visions. Ah, that would be Groa, the knowledge keeper. She was a gifted sorceress, who gathered every tome of arcane wisdom she could find in the realms, all in the hopes of augmenting her powers of prophecy, that she might find her lost husband, Arvandil. But it was not her husband she would glimpse in her visions, for it was Groa, seeing longer and farther than any before or since, who witnessed Ragnarok, the end and the beginning. When Odin caught word of her ultimate prophecy, he maneuvered to obtain her knowledge and hoard it for himself. Groa knew Odin as a long-time patron of her services, is Groa the giant? and so she welcomed him into her library as a friend. What she did not know is that Odin himself was behind her husband's disappearance, having used his enchantments to conceal his death at Thor's hands from her sight. Uh -huh. Smiling, jealous Odin took her by the throat, and with his very hands he stole her library and her life for his own. I always knew Odin was bad. That's just... Oops. The little rascal Thor. I'm gonna have to keep making excuses for him because he keeps going around murdering people. What a lovable rascal. You love Mimia's stories. He's what you want to be. Oh, I can totally see that. Oh my god, everyone needs a black or head to carry around and tell them stories. Um, you just saw the grabbed photo, Tom. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I thought you might enjoy pictures, so I was like, I'll put them on. Grow is a giant seer. Is that the one I think we saw in one of the wardrobe, um, stories? I think. Uh, so giant sorceress. Whoa, hi, welcome. <laughs> Little Heli, thank you for the raid. Welcome. How are you? <laughs> Hacking, hi. <laughs> How's it going? Celestial raid? That's a big raid. <laughs> so many shooting stars. How are we doing? Welcome. Oh, this would be good if I could remember how to do my shout out. I think it's Esso. <laughs> oh no, I am um, doing in caps. I hope it doesn't make a difference here. Hey, there we go. Thank you for the follow of 40 lives. Yeah. Oh, thank you, Hacking, for bringing the raid over. How are you doing? You, <laughs> you did just hear a cup. Rose is welcoming you all in. <laughs> How's it going? You've been playing Genshin Impact. I hope I said the name of that game right. How is it? I've never played that one. Is that one like Breath of the Wild or am I thinking of something entirely different? <laughs> Wait, is that Immortals something else? <laughs> I get games muddled up. How are we doing? Uh, we are currently playing God of War. We are like, I still think fairly early. Um, although far enough in that I recommend not being here if you're gonna play the game yourself because it's very, very good. And we are in like what I would consider spoiler territory. Um, yeah, this is Roz. Roz is saying hi. Roz has been very needy today because she's been left alone for a while. I'll just bring her up here and I know you can't see her, but let's <laughs> see if we can get her to settle again. Um, it's actually so fun. It's very Breath of the Wild. Excellent. Is is that the free one, or have I made that up? I I feel like I remember a free Breath of the Wildish game coming out a while ago, and I think that might be it. You love cats? Oh, she is. Um, she's an old girl, but she's very vocal. She's also deaf, so. That's why else she's very noisy. Uh, she has already had 
lots of food today, but I mean, if she doesn't sell, I'm gonna give her some supper because <laughs> she hungry girl. That's what she's saying. Every time you hear the meow, it's food, food, food. <laughs> When cats are being needy. Oh, that is some good cat emotes. Oh, I love that middle one. That's adorable. Oh my god, that cat has an opposable thumb. <laughs> That's dangerous. Um, You're going to sleep now? Well, thank you for coming along. Thank you so much. Uh, the monetization is gacha based, but I heard plenty of people say it's still good and you can totally play without needing to. Oh, it's definitely something what I would play at some point if like in the future if I can make a dent in my backlog. Just probably for myself though. Uh, once I've actually played Breath of the Wild because I haven't even gotten into that yet. Um, you don't spend any money on it. That's so good that there's like free to play games that like actually you can spend so much time in. That is awesome. You've heard that if you don't get caught up trying to earn or pay for all the random collectible characters, it is fun. That's very cool. Your backlog is intense. Yeah, I hear you there. <laughs> it never ends. It only ever gets bigger. Finish one game, add on three more. <laughs> well, thank you anyway. Thank you so much. This is like close to the most people that I've ever like spoke to out loud <laughs> so thank you so much for that and i really hope you had a great stream um gacha is chance based like those things you had ages ago that you can get collectibles in plastic balls and such right okay is it kind of like loot boxy things maybe is it is it linked to that um maybe not i don't know oh well thank you so much uh righty I saw <laughs> something you'll learn about me very quickly is I have a very bad memory. <laughs> we were listening to stories of Norse mythology. Uh, we just got some information about this giant called Groa. Giant sorceress and a powerful seer. Slain by Odin. Did he steal her book of visions? Yeah, this... No, no, no. This is... Look, there's the wardrobe that we found ages ago. Called the Knowledge Keeper, Groa was first to have a vision of Ragnarok. She trusted Odin as a friend. Bad idea. Something I have learned so far, never trust Odin. Never. Just never. Uh, gonna lurk and make some food. But you are super cute. Is that a hint of Geordie? Kind of. I'm, I'm a bit further south than Geordie, but close enough. But I had that question the other day as well, but I can't remember who it was that said it. Like, an hour south of Newcastle. <laughs> um. Alright. Never trust Odin. Wait, that's not Nodders. That's Nopus. That's the one. <laughs> Enjoy your food anyway. Yeah, happy lurking. Stories always go, so they trusted Odin, then Odin <laughs> murdered or cursed them. The end. That's every every story we've heard about Odin so far. Ruthless, barbaric, heartless, that's Odin. In fact, we would do well to sit here in silence for the next few moments and reflect on Odin's capacity for cruelty. I've just done that. I've just done that for a couple of minutes. And so... Reflect longer. <laughs> Okay, fair. Right, so this is a, again a warning for anyone uh, new in that hasn't played this game. And if you're planning on playing it, then I would recommend dipping out. Like, I don't like kicking people away from the stream, but I do it because I don't want to spoil anyone's game. Um, otherwise, also, I didn't even introduce myself. Welcome in. My name is Noob. Um... That's kind of all you need to know. I play games badly. Uh, I'm getting better. I like to be thorough. I like to try and find as many treasures and collectibles and lore as I can. Uh, we like to discuss it in the chat and everybody like keeps me updated on the things that I inevitably forget. 
Um, and that's kind of how we roll here. Wanna make me sweat? Holy Get shit! Some subs. Giraffe! <laughs> oh my goodness! Wow! <laughs> oh no! Now you're gonna hear me say that ten times. Giraffe! Thank you so much for gifting ten subs. <laughs> Holy sweat! Yep. <laughs> Oh, well, Giraffe, thank you so much for gifting subs to Verti, Davinoff, Intoxicate, Tunda, Cookie, Noob Mom, welcome back, Noob Mom, Jackal, gift some subs, Fede, Sunny, and Hal, thank you so much for gifting all those subs. Oh, God, holy sweat indeed. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very, very much. I really appreciate that. Oh, this is not a cult. This is a business course. Mark. <laughs> oh my God. So you're not going to get the, um, uh, no, we oh God. Get some soap. <laughs> the sweat intensifies. You're not going to see the notifications just yet, but Mac also just gifted Five, wait, can I count? Yeah, five subs too. Thank you so much, Mark. For gifting subs to Flora, 40 Lives, Kirsty, Raz Grizz, and Siberius. Welcome back, everybody, and welcome into new people. Thank you so much. You beans are crazy. Black has got all the quotes that I'm just reading out today. <laughs> Wanna make me sweat? <laughs> Gift some subs. No shit, I mean we are not a cult. Business course. <laughs> oh man, thank you so much. Uh, yeah, if you want to join in in any of the fun, we have like 400 quotes or something. Um, <laughs> if you type quote, you get a random out of context quote. Uh, we have Discord and stuff. If you just, if anybody wants to join. I uh, just type exclamation mark and then Discord. Wanna make me sweat? Gift some subs. <laughs> Classic noob sentence. I was gonna say, fuck, what was I gonna say? Every stream. Just a bit short of a hype train. <laughs> yeah, I think it's because it was all subs and it needs subs and bits, but I'm not sure if that's true. But you guys have done enough already, so thank you for that. That is many, many subs. Thank you very, 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 very Wanna much. Wanna make me sweat? Gift some subs. <laughs> We're gonna be hearing that for a while. <laughs> okay. Uh, you think, it, oh, it needs a third. It's not, it doesn't have to be bits and subs. It just needs three people. <laughs> you don't need to do it. If anyone wants to do it, you've got one and a half minutes. But also, like, if it was for the emote, it would need to get to level one. So I don't recommend just doing it for that. Wanna make me sweat? <laughs> Gift some subs. <laughs> Mac, thank you for the bit, Crafty. Thank you for the hundred bits. We'll In about ten minutes, we're gonna get <laughs> video game cool. Um, oh, holy shit! Level 3 completed! Choo choo, motherfuckers! <laughs> it went straight up to level 4! <laughs> I am doing it for the sweat! <laughs> Why do people like making me, make me sweat? sweat? <laughs> Jinx me. Um,. Since it was a lot of gift subs, you blast right up! Yeah, I'm glad that it counted them then, because sometimes we haven't figured out when it does count them or not. Oh, Mac, thank you so much for some more bits! 99 bits! We are 96 per- Oh! <laughs> Giraffe! <laughs> thank you for the bits! There we go, 100%! Hype! Wait, is that- we completed Wanna level four. Sweat? Gift some subs. Is there a level five? There is a level five, isn't there? Did we complete the hype train? Oh no, there's a level five. 
What um what emotes are available today? Oh the giraffe. We have that one. Well, a few of us have that one. Hype cheer. A chicken cheer. <laughs> oh my goodness, you guys are going nuts. Thank you so much. Mac for more bits. I make me sweat. Gift some subs. Giraffe for gifting a sub to Hacking. Thank you very, very, very much. <laughs> wow, choo choo motherfuckers indeed. Holy. So, oh my goodness. There is also a squirrelin popcorn. An evil, like, chipmunk. And, oh, it's the, it's the cute bird. We, a few of us already have that one too. Wanna make me sweat? Get some soap. <laughs> some more? Oh my god, Mac, thank you for the bits. Oh, good god. Salty nuts. As if this... <laughs> I've never seen that emote before for bits. That's funny. <laughs> Why nuts? Wait, why? Why? I understand the salt. Where did the nuts come from? Oh, because I, I said that you guys were nuts. <laughs> Wanna make me sweat? Gift some subs. Hades nuts kind of works for this game. <laughs> Shadow! <laughs> Thank you for the bits. So many bits. <laughs> so annoyed you have no idea what's happening with your card. Oh, that's so weird. Does it not... I can't remember how Twitch works. Does it not save your deets? By deets, I mean details. I don't think I've ever called details deets in my life. But I'm sweating so much right now that words... Wanna make me sweat? A weird. Give some soap. <laughs> These will be over soon, I promise. <laughs> then we'll get some fun quotes. <laughs> um... Twitch lab like a make bits. <laughs> Deets nuts. Oh, good God. <laughs> That's good. Oh, thank you, everybody. Thank you so much. Oh, you have the evil one? <laughs> Want to make me sweat? Gift some soap. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. Thank you, everybody. The hype tree is... Wait, can I... Oh, I can't even put Yomi in the party scene because he's gone away. He's not happy. God damn it. Twitch, don't be a bitch. Let Black will give bits. <laughs> that, that's beautiful, ma. That sounds like poetry. Oh my goodness, ma. Wanna make me sweat? Gift some soap. More bits. Thank you, ma. For some more bits. <laughs> Boy napping, yeah. Our other son. Because I've decided that Yomi is now our son. It's Boy's brother. Other boy. I, right, so in case you're like wondering why I'm not playing game. Also, I'm taking this opportunity for chin scratches for Roz. Uh, because she is enjoying them right now very thoroughly. Um... You'll have to call the bank tomorrow. <laughs> we do enjoy some crimey murder in here. Um, I'm sorry that it's not working, Blecko. That's a pain in the ass when that happens. I'm rich. <laughs> um, hello, Giraffe. Hello, I'm Blecko, and here are my bits. Don't expose Blecko's bits like that, Giraffe. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my god. Stream labs? Give it, don't just give Sam quotes. <laughs> oh my god. Thank you so my much, everybody. All sorts of really critters. <laughs> Man. Uh, thank you, Mac, as well. Your last bits. Thank you so very much. What did we get? Oh, it's a sh- I don't want to bust all that. <laughs> it's a shocked squirrel. Okay. 
Okay. So for anybody that's new around here, all these quotes are from games that we've played in the past. Um, we're Wanna gonna make me sweat. <laughs> Give us some subs. <laughs> we're gonna keep adding them as we go. Um, it's a scared squirrel. I didn't know it. Like it looks more hungry. Like it's gonna eat that note. But um, yeah, it's scared. It could be scared too. <laughs> So, I now have three of those emotes that are available there. I think Craft will have four of them. Um, thank you so much everybody, seriously. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Hardcore! <laughs> okay, the hype train has ended, so I should turn the thingy off. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine, let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. <laughs> what a beautiful tune. Absolute tune. It looks like it was just exposed what doing things. Is this? <laughs> oh yeah, I added some new ones. <laughs> that was Kratos being shocked <laughs> at the bits this one probably makes me uh get excited every time i want to start raving <laughs> what is this that actually was the moment that we met yami Holmes, you sneaky bastard i'll kill you <laughs> Roses just sat right in front of me, like between me and the microphone. So if I'm sounding muffled or anything, it's Roz. <laughs> Holmes, you sneaky bastard! I'll kill you! <laughs> I missed that game. That was hilarious. Oh no, that was that was the other game. Yeah, I missed the first one of that game. <laughs> was that the end of the alerts? Did we do it? Thank you everybody for that support, holy balls. Thank you very, very, very much. I really appreciate every single bit of it, thank you. Ros felt reply to the mic, yeah. <laughs> Ros is being that fluffy thing that you put on a microphone. You sound quite rosled, <laughs> yes. All right, shall we play some game? <laughs> How do we feel about playing some game? Uh, okay. <laughs> what were we doing? Right, we are making our way to the bridge. We're gonna speak to Yami, so this is actually gonna be really nice. But first, we're gonna see if we can light these braziers. Uh, because we found... Penis! <laughs> Like, there is a horn, but not a penis. <laughs> that was exceptional timing. Thank you, Mac, for some more bits. <laughs> oh, for God's sake. Ahead. How do we speak to the serpent? There's a horn on the platform <laughs> at the middle point of the bridge. Take me to it. Finally, that horn. We're going the horn. We're going to blow the horn. Uh, what I was gonna say is we found all the ciphers to be able to decipher some of these runes. Another name. Rota! It's as if they've been made into a memorial to the Valkyries. Ah. Oh. Like, I didn't know much about this game going into it, but the only thing I did know is there is something you can do with Valkyries that I assumed was like a a kind of optional collectible type thing. Uh, I don't know what it was, but something like that. <laughs> so we have three of these lit up now. We still can't do them all, but we, after we've done this section, I guess, we can go back around there and see if we can light up the ones on that side too. Uh, do we need to go to Brock before we blow the horn? I don't think we need to. 
My meal's like looking quite sunburned. I suppose it's difficult being ahead. Um. Oh, it's these guys. The little lizardy, newty thingies. I like them. Uh, do we. Penis! <laughs> No, we don't penis. <laughs> Thank you, Giraffe, for even more bits. You guys are going nuts. Absolutely nuts for the penis. <sighs> he should wear sunscreen. Like, oh, but that means we need to apply it to him. Applying sunscreen to his cheek. Oh, goodness. Uh, I'm feeling cheeky today. I don't know why. <laughs> Thank you, Giraffe. Oh, we've got some dialogue with Brock. <laughs> oh, almost forgot. Brock, this is our new friend Mimir. Oh yeah, hey, Mimir. look. Mimir. Oh, why didn't you say so? He knows why. I know why. You know you why. Know why. Quiet. No more of this. Are they you know the what? same person? Sorry, <laughs> We do not want to get involved in this, but I also want to know more. Can't you and Sindri just patch things up? Whatever happened couldn't be all that bad. You're family. Now don't be lecturing me about family. I ain't the one who forgot what her name stood for. What we made, the weapons we made were legendary across nine realms for more years than I can count. You just don't throw that away on account of one bad... One bad what? You one bad nothing. Ain't you got somewhere to be? One bad what? One bad decision? One bad weapon? One bad, like, egg? Hmm. I, I want to go and show Mimia to Sindri. Oh, Sindri's going to hate Mimia so much because he's going to get all German full on us. Okay, what's good? I wonder if Sindri knows him then and also dislikes him. Uh, Brock gets around though, he knows everyone. Uh, let's sell these artifacts. I knew that we got some. Okay, if that'll hold you for now. And then just check our upgrades. Have we upgraded all? No. All right, this one, yeah. Okay, we need more steel before we can do that. That's fine. Um, the ball. Something for the boy. Right, we need what a more you need? special thing for the ball. We need special thing for the axe. Okay, I don't think we've got anything to upgrade then. Sorry, dude. We were just wasting your time here. Actually, is this what we've got? Equipped. We could upgrade this just because we can. Uh, very low perk, protective barrier. Yeah, this is what we're still using. Let's do it. Shouldn't give you no trouble now. Because we can. Um. <laughs> One bad god. Yeah, it could have been that. Oh wait, I didn't have that equipped. Oh no, I've just upgraded a pummel that I don't even use anymore. You take care now. <laughs> oh yeah, it did not have the E on it telling me that it was equipped. So what do I have equipped then? Pummel? Pummel? Here it is, yeah. Oh, I mean this one. Yeah, I like this one. Oh, I'm such an idiot. Yeah, this is a bad memory thing happening. Right. So that's that done. So right, the other thing that we've got... Right, we have two options. Potentially. Apparently we can travel to Muffelheim? That's not what it's called. Muspelheim? Uh... Oh, we can blow the horn and speak to the world snack. 
I'm just gonna pop over here and see if it lets me actually do the thing. And that could make the decision for us. <laughs> Muspelheim, yeah, not Muffelheim. <laughs> I think I got Niffelheim and Muspelheim kind of tied together. You hear it's quiet there. Yeah. <laughs> Muppet time! Oh, that sounds terrifying. Imagine. Okay, um... Let, let's check. So Jotunheim is where we're heading for. I've gone the wrong way, haven't I? Oh, that's probably it. The one that's a little... Realm available. So if we press X, I think we're going to travel to the realm. Hmm. Imposing Niflheim. Oh no. <laughs> um. Heading. <laughs> so insensitive. Mimir is right here. I'm sorry. Okay, so right. I don't know if this is a choice. What do we want to do? Does anybody have any opinions? I kind of want to go here. Like, if I was just playing on my own, I would try this. I feel like as soon as I press X, it's going to go cutscene. You don't have an opinion? You do you try muscle. I'm... Right, there is one option that... Do it, noob! Do it! It being what you want. Okay. Okay. You can always come back if you change your mind. Well, I just had a thought that maybe... Do it, noob! <laughs> I guess we're doing it. Maybe this place is going to be overleveled for us. And, like, maybe we'll have a reason to go here later when we're stronger. But I'm happy to jump in and find out. <laughs> However, first I need to take a quick pee break. So it is pee break time. I'll put some clips on. And I'll be back very soon and then we're going to jump into this realm. And then from there, we'll probably be straight back uh, to go and blow the horn. The yummy, yummy horn. Hormy. No, no, not hormy. Yawny. I don't know. I'm trying to put the words together. It feels like they could, but I think I messed it up. Hydration reminder. Thank you very much, Mac. Everybody, don't forget to stay hydrated. Refresh your drinks uh, and yeah, refresh yourselves and I won't be long. <laughs>